Hi, I'm Natalie McNeil, and you are watching She Takes on the World TV, your weekly dose of soaring inspiration and practical advice to turn your small business into something big. I want to kick off today's episode with a fun little history lesson. Now, if you're a history PhD, please keep the fun bit in mind here because for the sake of brevity, I'm going to miss a few details. In 1519, Hernán Cortés landed in what's now Mexico to conquer the Aztec Empire and bring the riches and glory home to Spain. He had 600 men, and it's pretty hard for 600 men alone to conquer an entire empire. Others had tried and failed, but two things set Cortés apart. The first was that he was a gifted orator. Good enough that he could convince his men that although they were outnumbered, they were heading for glory and wealth. And number two is that he understood the importance of sweeping gestures. He made what could be seen as a very reckless move that is remembered in the history books. He instructed his men to burn all their boats. It was an incredibly dangerous move. If Cortes and his men were on the brink of defeat, he was going to leave them behind with absolutely no exit strategy. But incredibly, this decision to triumph or perish had an incredible effect on his men. They had no option but to win, and they brought down the Aztec Empire. Now, before I move forward, can I just say that I'm so glad that our community of conquerors totally redefines what it means to conquer? We conquer with so much love, bringing our gifts to the world, and I think it's so beautiful. So, let's go back. When is the right time to say, I'm doing this and there is no going back, when you're faced with a major task or challenge? I've burned the boats in my business more than once, but the most important time that comes to mind was a few years ago, before we built the gorgeous She Takes on the World site that we have today. Before that launch, I spent months designing a different version of the site. We launched it, and I hated it, and I knew that there was a better way for us to move forward as a company. Even though I had just invested in a new site, I decided to take the bigger risk and burn it all to start totally from scratch. It was really tempting, not gonna lie, to try and save pieces of the site because of that investment. But I looked at this as an opportunity to define my values as an entrepreneur. I wanna be totally okay with burning everything and starting from scratch when my gut feeling says that it's the right thing to do. And it also made a statement to my team about what kind of company we are. My actionable for you this week is to figure out which boat you need to burn. What is your heart telling you to move on from? Where do you need to take a new direction in your business or totally start from square one with no going back? I wanna know what boat you know you need to burn in a comment below. Thank you so much for watching this episode and I do hope you'll share this message with someone who might need to hear it. I will see you next time on She Takes on the World TV. I hope you liked the episode of She Takes on the World TV you just watched. And if you did, I would love to invite you to take my free 14-day conquer course to turn your small business into something big. Come on over to shetakesontheworld.com slash conquer course to sign up.